Right, we're off to Ludlow for the Tumor 2 Maiden Chase. One is Iron Maximus, Paul Rhodes, Tide Fighter, Paul Rhodes, Wan Lip, Darren Thompson. The newcomer West Ross for Darren French. Another newcomer Wizenstrom for Stu Gray. Arliston Edrak, Vinnie Gerard, Ashira Posh, David Robertson, Kajuna Surprises, James Shea. Out of the North, Patrick Gogan, Errol Vermeil, Megan, James Shea, and Out of the Angel, Patrick Gogan, those four all newcomers. And nothing fancy for Martin Leedham. So 12 horses in this maiden chase. Yeah, at Ludlow. And away they go, and it's a Wiesenstrom leads for Stu Gray to come to the first, and Wiesenstrom jumps it really well from Ashura Posh for David Robertson. Then Iron Maximus with one lip, and that one's inside. Uh, behind that tie fighter for Paul Rhodes. Uh, jumping that one well was uh, David Thompson's um, Wayne Lip. They're followed by the Grey Horse, Elevomus Megan. Then comes Nothing Fancy with Arlington Idrak behind that for uh, Vinnie Gerard as a jump the next. And we have a faller. Three fallers actually. Three down there. Could you surprise us? Tie fight and Arts of an Angel all go at that fence. That leaves nine horses in the race and Wiesenstrom travelling really well in front for Stu Gray from West Ross in second for Darren French in one lap for Darren Thompson followed by Martin Needham's Nothing Fancy. A sheer posh behind that with uh, on the outside that is Iron Maximus. In between horses is Arlington Edrak. Then on the rail is a uh, Alvam Elvamal Megan for James Shea in the back of the field, out of the north for Patrick Hogan. Nine horses left yeah, in the maiden chase. And jumping one in front is Wiesenstrom for Stu Gray from West Ross in second for Darren French. They come to the next. A slow jump and a bad mistake in third for nothing fancy. And Martin Eden has allowed Arlington Edrick to pass that one. On the outside, that is Ashura Posh as they dump the next. Out wide is Iron Maximus. On the rail is Darren Thompson's one lip. Then comes Al Vermal Megan for James Shea in the back of the field out of the north for Patrick Hogan. So Wiesenstrom, the leader, from West Ross in second. As they pass the stands for the first jump, and that, the water jump is the last jump, which is weird because that's not the last jump in reality. So Wiesenstrump jumps the last, which uh, the, will be the last next time round, which happens to be the water jump from West Ross in second. And nothing fancy is back in third on the outside. That is Arlington Edrak for Vinnie Gerard. The grey horse who's moved to from the back of the field is Elvamol Megan for James Shea. Iron Maximus is on that one's outside. In between horses is Ashura Posh for David Roseman. Then comes Wayne Lip. And at the back of the field pushed along is out of the north. For Patrick Hogan, about 10 minutes off the leader, who's going one in front, Wiesenstrom. For Stu Gray leads from West Ross in seconds. So they jump in a slow jump for the leader, allows West Ross to get a bit closer. Four lengths back to nothing fancy in third. Alvamol Megan, who's crept closer on the rail. What's oh, there's another faller there, and Arlington Edrek has gone. So only eight horses left now. Vinnie Gerard's Arlington in Edrek falls to that. Last fence, and they jump the next, and the slow jump at the back of the field by Alla the North. Only eight horses left standing there. Western Wiesenstrom still the leader from West Ross in second. Nothing fancy is moving up on the inside of that. Then comes Ashura Posh as they jump the next. Art White and Maximus is moving forward strongly. Nowhere to go for Wendler behind horses. Then comes the grey horse, Alvin Mill, Megan, and Alla the North is losing touch at the back of the field. So only seven horses that matter here, yeah? and as Wiesenstrom still the leader for Stu Gray from Iron Maximus has travelled strongly on the outside of uh, Shura Posh has been pushed along to improve position. Out loud, out loud, James Shares, Alvamol, Megan is moving strong, strong, strongly. In the clear now is Wanlap for Darren Thompson, and nothing fancy is going backwards. West Shores is starting to struggle. There's still Wiesenstrom in front for Stu Gray from Ashura Posh in second. Then Iron Maximus now being pushed along. Wanlap is going well between horses, and as Wanlap comes to join Wiesenstrom now, Wiesenstrom, the long term leader been joined by Wayne up on the outside also Albemarle Megan is there nothing fancy between horses nowhere to go for nothing fancy it's on the inside Wiesenstrom Wayne up on the outside Wayne up picks it up now for Darren Thompson from Wiesenstrom is trying to get weary and Wayne up starts to draw clear Wayne up for Darren Thompson jumps it really well the last and Wayne up is moving clear for Darren Thompson and Wayne up's going to win the maiden chase at Ludlow jumps the water jump which is the last jump last well, and Wayne Lepp's going to win from Insurer Posse in second. I'm Maximus of third. The long time leader Wiesenstrom faded out to finish fourth. Good run by Wiesenstrom. It's a two mile two race, so probably a drop in triple suit him. And don't know why the water jump is the last jump, but anyway. Wayne Lepp wins from Assure Posh in second. I am Maximus for Paul Rhodes is back in third. Darren Thompson gets another winner. Wiesenstrom, a good run for Stu Gray back in fourth, and then came nothing fancy for Martin Eden, who finished back in fourth. Only eight horses finished in that race.